What is up guys, Michael Patrick Strauch here from the Wix Training Academy and today I'm coming to you with an update video. So a lot of you over the past probably six months have asked the question, how do I add Google AdSense to my Wix website? Well, I did a video on this quite a while back. In fact, I believe it was over a year ago, maybe even a year and a half. And Wix constantly updates in a good way. They're always adding on new features, progressing their app market, progressing their apps, and just adding on different elements of the platform. It's fantastic. I love watching it evolve. But with that, I've had videos that I've created a little further back that need to be updated. So one of my goals for uh, the end of the year into 2019 is to go back, look at my videos, and see some of them that need to be updated and update them. That's one of my big goals along with building out a social network in Wix. Those are my two big video series type I'm going to be doing. So with that said, before we hop into it, come over to wixtrainingacademy.com, guys. Link in the description below. Click this Academy button. Tons of free content, webinars, courses that I've created for Wix. Um, you'll click that and it'll just have you register an account completely free, email, password, so that way you can log back in later. Awesome stuff. Go do that. Link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe down below at Wix Training Academy. Turn on those notification uh, bell so that way you never miss a video. Now let's talk about this. How do we add Google AdSense to our Wix website? Well, it's very easy to add it, but I'm going to go into it a little deeper. So we're going to go to Add Apps over here on the left. You can see I've already typed it in. You would just type in AdSense in here or even Google and scroll through and look. So since the last video, Wix has done some updating with the Google AdSense uh, app. And it's all been good updates. For a little while there, it was even off the app market as they were adjusting it. But now what we're going to do is we're going to click Add to Site. Once we do that, we'll literally see the Wix, or excuse me, the Google Ad appear. Now you'll see right here, Add Title Text will be displayed here. So there's nothing actually there right now. If we click Settings on that, I'm going to go through the design aspect first and then we'll go through the content base of it. So for the actual app itself, you can see right here, you can choose the design. Do you want it to be a text ad? Do you want it to be an image ad? Or do you want it to be a text and image ad? So you can choose what type of ads are added here, and you can go ahead and customize the content and layout just like you'd like it. So all that is totally on you, depends on your website. And then if we come down here to layout, you can choose whether it's square, tall, or a wide ad right here. And you'll see that stretches across the page. Let's just have it square for right now for the point of this video. And finally, you can choose the style of the ad. So you can choose the type of font it is, the size, the text color, URL color, border. All that good stuff can be added right here from the design portion of the settings in the Google AdSense app. So to actually get started to connect your Google AdSense account and actually start the process, you'd press get started right here and then it would take you to your Google account. You'd then sign in with your AdSense account. So whatever your Google AdSense account is that you want these ads to be under is the account you need to sign in with on Google. Once that happens, what you need to understand is Google is very picky now about where they put ads. So they do not want to put ads on some random no content website with a free Wix URL. If that's your website, it's okay. There's no need to take offense to that. I'm just being completely honest with you. I see a lot of times people try to start a blog or they try to start a website and instantly add Google AdSense to their website in hopes to start generating revenue right away. Unfortunately, Google doesn't function like that anymore. So in order for you to maximize your possibility of getting approved, to be on the Google AdSense list, what you need to do is build out your website completely, start posting some content to it, have design elements, go through the Wix SEO wizard which connects straight to Google, go through step by step on that thing and make sure all the checklists are checked off, add content, blog content, text content, image content, video content, make sure your website is reputable, make sure your website is value filled. If you can meet those criteria, plus meet the criteria of creating a solid uh, Wix SEO playbook and going through the guide, and you uphold Google's rules and standards, you should have no problem being approved for Google AdSense. 
But until all of those criterion are met, you're going to struggle getting approved. So what happens if you get declined? You go through and do exactly what I just told you and resubmit your site to Google. Now, if you do it too much and you start going wild and you just keep trying to post it, post it, post it, approve it, approve it, approve it without getting changed, you are at a likelihood of your Google AdSense account being suspended. I don't want that to happen to you. And I've had a lot of people contact me over the past year about that have told me, oh, Google declined me or Google uh, suspended my account. You have to make sure there is solid, steady content on your website. You meet all of the Wix SEO standards. Go through each check on that checklist. Post value on your website. Post good content. And make sure your website is filled out. Make sure it's not just one blank page with nothing going on. Have a solid content base. That's what Google's looking for. At the end of the day, Google just wants to make sure you have a reputable website with good value. The last thing I need to tell you is Google will not approve your website if it's like a .wixsite.com. They want reputable websites, which means you need to get a hosting plan and you need to get a domain name, an actual domain name, a .com, .org, .net, whatever you want it to be. It doesn't that doesn't matter. You just need to get a domain name so that you're reputable. Otherwise, if you have a free Wix account, Google reads that as almost spammy. You're trying to drive people to a website with a free Wix account that's not 100% reputable and just trying to make money off of ads, which in some cases a lot of you are trying to do. And I'm not trying to call you out. I'm just saying I've seen it happen time over time and time again. I don't want that to happen to you. So please make sure when you do this, you do it properly. You could consider this my update video heading into 2019 on how to add Google AdSense to your Wix website. If there's updates or changes that happen to occur in the next couple of months, I will be sure to make an updated video once again. If you enjoyed this video and it helped you out, please drop a like down below. Comment if you have any questions, concerns, anything at all. And don't forget to subscribe at Wix Training Academy right down below. And finally, last but not least, head over to wixtrainingacademy.com where you get access to tons and tons of my free content that I want you to learn from. I want you to take it and learn from it. I've got blog posts. I've got webinars. I've got masterminds. I've got checklists. I've got uh, roadmaps. I've got a whole bunch of stuff on there. So go check it out. Just click this Academy button. If you want to start a project with me, start a project with me. Click this Academy button right here. It'll take you to register and you'll be all set and ready to go. Guys, I really appreciate it. As you can see, I got my Christmas, Christmas lights in the back. I'm ready for Christmas. I'm ready to go into our new year strong. And I hope this video helped you out and put you on the right track to head into your new year with Google AdSense on your Wix website. Thank you guys again, and I will catch you on our next video.